Milk Security Test is a rapid strips test for detection of adulteration in raw milk. In many countries, where milk producers are mainly small farmers, adulteration is done for increasing some of the measured parameters in milk and its purchase price. How to use? First, test pure milk without adulterations. To do this, open the cap of the test tube. Take one test tube for testing, then immediately close the tube. Dip the indicator zone of the test strip in the milk sample, leave it there for 3 seconds. After the test strip is taken out of the milk sample, completely remove all milk drops from it by tapping on the edge of the cup. Place the test strip on the paper towel for complete absorption of the milk residues. Wait 60 seconds. Compare the color of the test strip with the color scale on the label. When there is no adulteration, the indication zone is not changing its color. Second sample is milk adulterated with neutralizers. The most common neutralizers that are used for adulteration of milk are sodium bicarbonate, sodium hydroxide and sodium carbonate or hydrated lime. They are often added to milk for increasing the lactometer's readings. Neutralizers influence the values of titratable acidity and pH of milk. That's why they must be checked in the milk sample. When there is adulteration with neutralizers, the first indication area is changing its color from orange to orange-red. The third sample is milk adulterated with hydrogen peroxide. Hydrogen peroxide is commonly used for cleaning in dairy industry. However, the peroxide sanitizer may not be totally washed off after the cleaning. Residues may remain in the dairy equipment and can enter the milk supply. Milk security test strips ensure that the dairy area is safe and free from peroxide and no residues of peroxide sanitizer have mixed up with milk. When there is adulteration with hydrogen peroxide, the second indication area is changing its color from light yellow to blue. Fourth sample is milk adulterated with urea. Urea is generally added in milk for increasing of solid non-fat value. It has been proven that urea added to milk at a higher concentration reduces the acidity of the hydrogen ions and increases the pH of the milk. When there is adulteration with urea, the third, last indication area is changing its color from yellow to pinkish red. Fifth sample is milk adulterated with neutralizers and urea. Neutralizers change the color of indication area of urea. In case a positive result for neutralizers is received, the urea result must be compared with the second color scale.
when there is adulteration with neutralizers and urea. The third, last indication area is changing its color from yellow to intensive pinkish red. What is the result? Milk security tests help only pure milk to be used in the dairy industry.